I just so like the era of the 50s. It would be cool to be back there at that time. The music, the automotive design, the time before the internet. I'm looking out the front windshield and it's black and white. I knew by the time I was 12, I wanted to be an artist. I don't think I've changed since I was like a teenager. I still have the, the mind of like a graffiti writer, a vandal, a, you know, a low rider, you know. Uh, even though I'm married with four kids, uh, sitting in the baby valet at the private school, I'm thinking about like riding on the side of the freeway. What means most to me in life is my children. It's changed over the years. If you would have asked me when I was 20, I would have said money. My family is, is what's gonna carry on my message, what's gonna carry on my, my art, you know, what's gonna carry on uh, my memories. I lived through them. Prior to that, it was all about me. I like to focus on the present moment but I also look to the future of where I'm gonna be at in 10 years. Being in the present moment is, is most important. You always have to learn. You're, you're never all the way gonna be there or be satisfied. So I guess when I'm done doing that, it'll be time to fall back. I got no problem with that, you know, but I think in your brain, you'll be inspired like, to have your kids doing, helping your kids and helping other people. I got another 15 years to go till I retire. I'm gonna take it to 65, then I'll, I'll smooth out, ease up, you know what I mean? People are, I'm gonna retire at 49, bullshit. You're gonna to get to 49 and just start getting it going, man, and be like, okay, now, now I can see it. Now the, now the, the smoke is clearing, you know what I mean? So, they say you hear a big pop when you turn 50. That's your head coming out your ass. We'll see.